Hello grade 11s, today we're going on to finding the values for which identities are undefined working from slides 150 to 155 from the trig powerpoint. Now if we think about when things are undefined that's normally when we're dividing by zero okay and you've seen a lot with these trig identities that we've done you have fractions okay and those trig functions at the bottom can't be zero otherwise you're dividing by zero and you get undefined okay so that's just something to note uh, when the denominator is zero the second thing i want you to know is if you have a tan theta in your identity straight away i want you to write this okay uh, obviously you don't have to write if identity contains tan theta but you will be writing this theta is equal to 90 plus k180 where k is an element of the integers okay so that'll become a little bit more clear now when we go through an example so if we look at example one uh, they're asking us for which values of x is the identity cos x plus cos x times tan squared x equals 1 over cos x undefined okay so if we ever look at this identity we don't have to prove it but we just have to show where this thing would be undefined so straight away we have a tan x so i'm going to be using this thing over here so straight away we know that x will be equal to 90 degrees plus k 180 where k is an element of the integers and I just want to make a note here for you guys. This was because we had the tan x. Don't worry about the squared bit. Just because we have tan x, I've done that. Now, you can also see now that we have this thing over here. We have something in the denominator. That cos x cannot be equal to 0. If it's equal to 0, then we've got 1 divided by 0, which is undefined. So the next thing that we've got is cos x equals to zero and I'm going to solve for this okay and you know what the general formula for cos is it's whatever the angle is equals plus or minus shift cos of that angle so if I can find my calculator which is somewhere around here here it is and we go shift cos zero we get 90 so it'll be plus or minus 90 degrees plus k360 where k is an element of the integers okay and those are our two general formulas for when this uh, identity would be undefined all right going on to example two Okay, again, it's saying for which values of x is this identity cos x minus sin x over cos x plus sin x equals 1 minus tan x. over 1 plus tan x okay so where is this identity undefined all right now because we have the first thing because we have a tan i must state what i did with the first one okay straight away x is equal to 90 degrees plus k 180 where k is an element of the integers. All right. So that's because we have a tan x. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at my denominators. Start with this one. So this cos x plus sin x cannot be equal to zero because if this whole thing is zero, then we're dividing by zero. So I'm going to have a look at that one. Cos x plus sin x equals to zero. Now, this is very similar to what you guys have done before. 
I'm going to take the cos x to the other side and we get sin x is equal to minus cos x. Divide both sides by cos x. Sine over cos is tan x equals cos x divided by cos x is 1 and we have minus 1 there. Okay, so um, to solve for this one, it would be x is equal to, and then we go shift tan minus 1 equals, and we get negative 45. And you remember with tan, it's plus k180, where k is an element of the integers. All right, now I'm going to look at my next one which is this thing here. 10x plus 1 cannot be equal to 0. Okay. Now, I know I keep saying it can't be equal to 0, and here I'm setting it equal to 0. It's because I want to solve for where it would be undefined. Okay. So don't put a little line through there. To solve for this, we get 10x is equal to minus 1, which is exactly the same as this. But I'm just going to write out the solution again, okay? X is equal to minus 45 plus K180, where K is an element of the integers. And there our solutions are. We have that one, that one, and that one. Right, grade 11s, I would like you to do exercise 7.13, A, B, C, F, and H for me, please. Thank you.